everyone, I'm Titis and today I'm gonna change my air filter. I bought this uh, spring filter, it's P08 and that's for sweet use. What we're gonna start with is to take off the tank cover. It's um, seven bolts, uh, which this one is uh, longer than the other ones. So we start with that. So now I've taken out all the bolts and we're going to remove this. So here is her heart. So here you have another bolt you need to take away. This one and the one that was here is longer than the other ones. Hold on. So now I have to remove this wire that is attached to the ECU. Just pull it up. Just put it here on the side. Now I can lift the ECU off. Pull it forward and up and back. So here we have it. As you can see, it's two of these. We need to open it up. Then we need to open this one. This is just a plastic screw. Let's see, yeah, there we got it. So, and now we can open it up start with this little box here. Let's pull it out. And then when I remove this, I need to take the air filter with me. Sometimes a bit stuck. Let's see, yeah, there I got it. And just pull it gently up. So, here we got it. <laughs> oh, look here. I got some friends with me, free riders. <laughs> so I'm gonna take away the filter and just clean this plastic a bit. So the plastic is cleaned. So I'm gonna take out my new fancy print filter. Oh, looks good. The print filter is, um, contains only one layer of polyester, as comp if you compare it to the original ones that's uh, in paper. So you can see, you can almost see through it. So then when you do this, you always need to have one of these available, a bit. So we're going to put in the filter, just going to remove it from the grass because I don't want grass in it. Voila. Let's put it in. I just placed the ECU like this. I was fixing it up. As you can see, this air filter has this uh, rubber around it and if you look down here there is a screw that you want to have this rubber inside so i'm just gonna put it down gently as gently as i can so when you got it down here you can just like play with it a bit to see that it's sealed as you can see the rubber band is inside the groove now so everything looks good so now we can lock it up. Voila. Now 
card and you have this little dot for the screw. So just place it down here. And as you can so now you see the foam is standing up, so I'm just gonna put it down a bit so it's completely sealed. Now I have this um, plastic screw. You can just push it in and then push it down and it's locked. So the ECU comes down. It's a little bit tricky. And I have this one. Not to forget this one. Put it in the claw like that. And so now I want the um, short one of the two long one. Just gonna see. It starts to get darker so I can see. That's chick. So this one here, that's in aluminium, so you need to be very careful that you're not tightening too hard, so it's damaged. So the, now the last thing is to put this back, remember the long screw in front, so um, according to Brock's performance, this sprint filter gives you around three to four extra horsepowers and we all love those horses so um, thanks for watching please subscribe leave a comment and tell a friend <laughs>